expecting? Well, I'm expecting excitement. I'm excited for those players in the dressing room. You can just see the nerves twitching behind those eyes. I'm pretty sure the whole game plan has been done before in the dressing room. They know what they've got to do. The difficulty is, this is the Champions League final. They've got to go and produce. As prize assets go, this man tops a lot. Well, he's an absolute legend and he's gone on to now hopefully conquer another league, challenging himself every day of the week in training, now challenging himself at Juve. The old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Wojciech Szczesny between the posts. And leading the attack today is the heart to contain Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's going to end in glory for one team and bitter disappointment for the other. Well, big night call for big players. And there's a few on both teams tonight. Who will come out on top? I'm pretty sure it's going to be a great game, tactically, physically, and I think we're going to get some goals as well, Derek. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely, that takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned club kings of Europe. And now Ronaldo. Now Radio. Haxler now. Can they hit on the break? Well, sadly, from their point of view, it petered out. Verratti now. Mbappe. Across from Mbappe. And the defender finding a solution to the problem. Mbappe with it. And Neymar. It's there for him. And that was a heaven-sent opportunity to take the lead so early. First goal is so important, Derek. Sometimes you're not ready. Well, you really must be ready this early in the game. Good tackle. And a chance for them to nudge in front. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Here's Ronaldo. Radio. Neymar. Well, he's setting the table for his team. Given away by Radio. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Verratti. Cavani. Running towards goal. One man to beat. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options on as well. Beautifully timed. They might see the wide route as a fruitful one, PSG. Will there be a tangible end product? It's going to be Neymar. The goal then for Paris Saint-Germain. The first one of this Champions League final. Oh, they've got the noses in front. Can they stay there? Now the other team are playing catch-up. And so back playing again. PSG with the lead. Maxler now. He's given it away. Yeah. 
Joao Cancelo, Dybala. I must say, the one thing that strikes you when you cover a Juventus match, Lee, is that they are very much a team for all of Italy, based in Turin, but Italy's club. Well, absolutely. The DNA of an Italian club is right there in front of your eyes. Everything they do, the way they go about the game, and the style they go about it in is just... I think they're just a brilliant outfit. Carrying a genuine threat here. And the post coming to the goalkeeper's aid. He's played it out over the touchline. So a throw in to restart things. Costa with it. Excellent challenge. Well, the quarter-final has tended to be the exit point for PSG in recent years, Lee. And two years ago, they had that wretched experience against Barcelona. Yeah, absolutely. I always see Paris Saint-Germain as that smaller club looking in at all the big clubs, waiting to be invited into the gang. And uh, certainly now, the way they're playing, I think they're ready to be invited. I think the door's open. Walk on in. And the penalty has been given here. And the tackle deemed sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card for Chiellini. Definite yellow card for the big centre-back. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Now Chiellini. Bonucci. Cancelo, Juventus keep possession and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Can he get them level? Off the post and back in play. Corner coming up for Juventus. Maneuvering his way forward. Now, what could he do here? Chance for Dybala. And Juventus have done it. A goal for them. Level pegging. The keeper's got no chance. It's all about the strike, all about the power. He does everything right, head down, back of the net. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. <laughs> well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Verratti. Mbappe with it. It's with Dybala. Juventus have given it away. The tackle crisp and accurate. Quadrado. Throw in here for PSG. Axler now, Verratti now, Cavani, now Kurzawa, Axler, making excellent progress with the ball at his feet, can he give them the lead, Chiellini keeps it out, and the PSG corner, And they've gone for the short corner. Rabio. Neymar. And dispossessed. Pjanic. Joao Cancelo. Quadrado. Pjanic now. Dybala.
Verratti. Kurzawa. Cavani. This is Neymar. Neymar playing with purpose and control. A drop. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. And fired from the flank into the area. But well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Neymar. Well, he's setting the table for his team. Cavani! Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time, he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. Kadira. Here's Ronaldo. It's with Dybala. Douglas Costa tremendous intuition to win it back half time then and we're sorry for the pause in the proceedings here Lee because this has been a thoroughly riveting Champions League final so far well it has, great game sometimes finals can be cagey affairs but not this one, let's hope and they get the ball rolling in the Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. And it's Cavani. It's with Dybala. Quadrado. All ball, no doubt about it. And he's been a bit unlucky. It'll be a throw-in. Kadira. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Thiago Silva Verratti Mbappe with it good use of advantage in favour of PSG well it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper Alexandro Eye-catching and effective in the first half. Paulo Dybala. Dybala really is obsessed with taking the game to the opposition. But can they produce from here? Clattered away. Here's Mbappe. Verratti now. Mbappe. Corner awarded to PSG. PSG have been readying two substitutes, and now both will come on. Fired in by Neymar. Has he got a score? And what's he going to do? And Kunku. Cristiano Ronaldo. Quadrado. And the counter-attack is on, options available. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Marquinhos. Verratti. Nkunku. Verratti. Neymar. The tackle crisp and accurate. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Janic. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Neymar dispossessed. Here is Dybala. 
driven home by Dybala. Hit the target, tick, power, tick, goal, tick. A chance to revisit the goal. Pointing for PSG to concede the goal. Now well, let's see if they can attack with vigor. Given away by Verratti. Pjanic. Verratti now. Here's Mbappe. Now Chiellini. Joao Cancelo. Juventus have given it away. He has plenty of support. Is he going to punish them here? Well, they get high marks for that move, but they couldn't make it count. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. to go really he's being closed down so a throw in here Pjanic Dybala ball lost by Juventus That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Kadira. Cristiano Ronaldo. Thiago Silva. Neymar. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. Oh, surely. And Ronaldo with the goal. Brilliant, brilliant finish. but what can they do? It's a lovely strike off his laces in the back of the net. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. shortage of goals in this match 3-1 Verratti Cavani Cristiano Ronaldo given away Dybala and he's broken free can he beat the goalkeeper and a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot straight at him, no problem for the goalie. He's just a thorough reader of the game, and there we saw it. No foul, PSG advantage. Well, let's see, does he mean business? Space afforded PSG. Thunders clear. Douglas Costa. And just the one minute left in normal time here. 
We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Read it superbly to take back possession. Verazzi now. Neymar. Minier. This is Neymar. Italy's old lady has passed the final test. Juventus are the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, you have to say, fully deserved as well. All those months of toil, the training sessions, etc. The sacrifice, the commitment, the desire, the hunger. The look as well, but the application to put all that into a package and then win this brilliant trophy. They do set very high standards for themselves, these Juventus players. But this is something they will remember forever. What a feeling of pride it must give you to be able to say you're part of the team that's the best in Europe League. Well, you know, these players get paid fortunes. Bank accounts are full of money, but it doesn't matter. It's about memories. When you finish your career, you look back at these moments. How many trophies have I won? How many times have I celebrated on a podium with this famous trophy? The buoyant Bianconeri. Juventus lift the Champions League trophy. Brilliant moment, especially for the captain. He gets his hands on the trophy first. Well, they certainly intend to savour this. Juventus, and they ought to. Doesn't come along every night of the week. The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands. Let them enjoy the experience with you. And the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It took fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Now the chance for a photograph. My mum always told me to get on the front row. She taught you well, Lee. There we have it. The Champions League victors for 2019. Mbappe with it. And Neymar, it's there for him. And that was a heaven-sent opportunity to take the lead so early. First goal is so important, Derek. Sometimes you're not ready. Well, you really must... Running towards goal, one man to beat. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options. You might see the wide route as a... Will there be a tangible end product? It's going to be Neymar. The goal then for Paris Saint-Germain, the first one of this Champions League final. Oh, they've got the noses in front, can they? And the penalty has been given here. And the tackle deemed sufficiently sinister to warrant a yellow card for Chiellini. Definite yellow card. Now, what can he do here? Chance for Dybala. And Juventus have done it. A goal for them. Level pegging. Well, he's setting the table for his team. Cavani! Great chance with that header. But he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar this time. He... And here is Dybala. Driven home by Dybala. Possibilities for Douglas Costa. Oh, surely. And Ronaldo with the goal. Brilliant, brilliant finish. Mbappe with it. 